Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And recently, I had a few people comment and email me about the situation in San Francisco. So in late 2020, T-Mobile filed a lawsuit against the state of, uh, well, you know, San Francisco, the city of San Francisco within the state of California. They filed a lawsuit against them because T-Mobile was making no progress. The city kept denying them up, just up, simply upgrading its already existing cell sites. So San Francisco was behind on the extended low band deployment, the band 71 and 71. They're for sure behind on the N41 5G deployment. So T-Mobile took them to court. And we knew back then under the FCC ruling, San Francisco would lose and T-Mobile would win. So I just wanted to give you guys a brief update on how that is going. So about five months ago or so, around March of this year, T-Mobile got a partial grant to that motion. So that essentially gave T-Mobile confidence that they would win the entire case. And I know this is a bit older. It's still from this year, but this was around March. I'll just read it off briefly. On Thursday, Judge Suzanne Ilston of the Northern District of California issued an order granting in part T-Mobile's motion for summary judgment and granting in part its motion for preliminary injunction against the city and county of San Francisco following a March 12th hearing. So, and the matter regarding its cell site applications. So I'm hearing, I've reached out to a couple of my sources. I'm hearing they're making a lot more progress since then. So I don't know if we'll get another update this year stating that the case has been fully closed, T-Mobile 1. We likely will. I have absolutely no doubt that T-Mobile will win this. T-Mobile is going to win this lawsuit 100%. They at least, San Francisco needs to grant them access to upgrading its already existing infrastructure. That needs to happen. They need to be able to get up there. The baseband units need to be swapped out where they need to be swapped out. They need to get the, the big N71 panel and then they need to get the massive MIMO panel up there and they need to do it quick. They have the funding. The funding is there. The money's there. It's just uh, the city of San Francisco has not been playing fair game with T-Mobile. So let me know what you think about this in the comment section down below. I just wanted to give out this update. A lot of you have been asking recently. So yes, T-Mobile is making progress. Earlier in the year, they got a partial grant and I'm hearing it's already been, there's already been a lot more progress made since then. So if you have been on the channel or you're new to the channel and you have not yet liked, share, subscribe, make sure you do so. Hit the notification bell so you are notified when I do upload content. Make sure to follow all of my social media outlets for more updates and interaction. Thanks again for watching. This is Tyrone with Tech Life. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.